Hello everybody, welcome to Short Shot Archery. Anthony here, and today I got my new arm guard. So I've been using a biter arm guard for quite some time now, but every year or so from all the shooting I'm doing and you know from having this outside and the fact that it is just plastic, I wear them out. So I wanted to do a video to show you what you get when you buy a brand new biter arm guard and give you a review on the abuse <laughs> my uh, past biter arm guards have taken from me. So first we're going to start off with the brand new one. It's nice and shiny. Um, I'm going to open this up. It comes very well packaged from biter. Open that up. We got the top off. Now we just have the bag. Comes in a little Ziploc. And we have a couple pieces. By the way, these straps do feel really great on your arm when they're brand new. They get a little rough after uh, you put some mileage on them. Um, as you can see with these, they're, they're pretty rough. <laughs> but uh, these brand new ones, they feel really great on your arm. Um, we also have two clasps. So uh, there we have it. We have all the pieces to the uh, new arm guard I have here. Um, comparing the two, you can definitely see uh, there's a bit of a color difference. The sun really uh, takes its toll. It didn't help this time. This one actually snapped, which was a bummer. But uh, it must have gotten stuck in a hard spot in my case when I closed it. And then through airplane travel, probably got crunched because it came out broken so eh. duct tape fixed it and a little bit of super glue did the job made it through the tournament um, let's see what else do we get uh, directions showing you uh, potential layouts and setups and how to set up your arm guard so that's very awesome So now I'm just going to put uh, the new one aside. You saw all the pieces and you know, it gives you a nice little construction project <laughs> to put together the new one. Uh, now back to my old one, um, for the most part it's it served me well. There is some like minor like eh, I guess structural things that we end up running into after a long period of, uh, of using this. You know I am going about a year plus before I have to... Uh, you know, buy a new one of these, but uh, on the back, there's uh, several small sections that end up always getting cracks, because this isn't my first one. I've gone through like three or four of these now. So I do have a lot of experience, and they always, uh, they always do crack in the same area, right where you put the uh, straps to go onto your arm. I guess the force of, of you just putting it onto your arm and taking it off you know, every day, maybe a couple times a day. Um, eventually, it wears on those thinner plastic pieces, and they do break. You can get around it though, since they do leave you with many holes. Uh, of course, most of these are for not sweating, you know, so much when you have the arm guard on. But um, you can run the straps through those holes, and you can get even longer life out of your arm guard. So. Uh, Overall, I'm very happy with, with uh, how it's set up. It does fit uh, very well on your arm. It is nice and low profile. If you're a beginner, you may have to get more than one of these. Personally, my recommendation is this arm guard's more for somebody uh, intermediate and, adv and advanced, somebody that doesn't hit their arm anymore. You know, you've, you've learned to you know, set your shoulder and your arm correctly during your shot so you're not hitting your arm. Uh, because it doesn't co it doesn't have a lot of coverage, and um, it's more for you know the occasional mistake where you're gonna hit in this section, and at the same point in time it does have an it's it's a lot of uh, like style because they do come in several different colors. You know, there's uh, fluorescent colors. There's uh, this is the heavy green color, so. You can, you can mix and match and you know get it to match up with your bow. If you did three colors, you could probably actually cover most of the flags out there. And at the same time, you could give yourself 
a lot of arm coverage. So uh, there's a lot of possibilities with it. It does fit nice. Um, you know, as you can see, I'm, I'm on another one now. I've owned like, we're on, no, I think this is the fifth one. So they have worked out for me. So hopefully you've enjoyed this review. And uh, if you're interested in picking one up, um, I always buy mine from Lancaster, but then again, they're right around the corner since I live in the United States. So thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed this review. And as always, happy shooting.